I know, they're, they're like feeding him, everybody's got different spoons, they're like feeding him, he's like, nah, nah, bring it on, nah. He's like, this is not pudding, puts it in his mouth, what is it? <laughs> God, I can't get over it. <laughs> so good. What is it? <laughs> jury huh? duty, jury duty, blackmail, pink slip, eviction, eviction notice. <laughs> eviction notice. <laughs> <laughs> eviction notice, jury duty. <laughs> what an so, evil bastard. So funny, dude. What is going on, everybody? It is the Phantom Michael bringing you episode number 17 of our Pokemon Black 2, White 2 randomized Soul Link Challenge. I am, of course, joined with the one, the only, DJ Spinda. What's going on, guys? DJ Spinda here. All right. Let us do a quick team recap. Um, on the last episode, if you did not see, it's over on DJ Spinda's channel. We took on the gym leader. Um, so now we're going to make our way through some stuff. Up first on the squad, I have Slifer the Rayquaza with Twister Fly Crunch and Hyper Voice. And linked with Slifer is Caesar, the muscle band holding Primeape with Cross Chop, Seismic Toss, Assurance, and Rock Tomb. Up next, we have my girl the Iron Maiden with Gyro Ball rolled out, Curse and Metal Claw. And Iron Maiden is linked with Django Unchained. Holding that scope lens, rocking out with Aerial Ace, Brick Break, Chip Away, and Blaze Kick. Up next, we have my girl, the starter that you guys chose, Janet the Jellicent with the moves Recover, Water Pulse, Absorb, and Ominous Wind. And Janet is linked with Enchantress, the Sigilith, holding that Leftovers, rocking out with Side Beam, Air Cutter, Hypnosis, and Blizzard for them pesky, pesky flying types. And last but not least, we have my guy, Stainless the Steelix, rocking out with the moves Curse, Rock Throw, Super Fang, and Stealth Rocks. And linked with Stainless is the always clutch Gertrude, holding that Rocky Helmet, rocking out with the moves Nightshade, Thunderbolt, Will-O-Wisp, and Hex. And Gertrude earned the title Legend Killer Dude, from the last episode. Mm, if you guys have not seen it, go check it out clutch. over on DJ Spinner's channel. Um, we got the encounter for this place on the last episode. Yeah, Route 6. We got, uh, the, Sweetness and yeah. Muddy. Um, I believe the next agenda is to go back up here and battle, uh, uh, the, uh, yep, the yep. Sweetish guy up top over here. Yeah, I forgot. He asked us at the end of last one. He's like, do you want to battle? We're like, uh, no. Nope. <laughs> no, thank you, sir. Swerve, um, man. Swerve. Before we do that, I just want to go... I just want to run around this town for a, for a hot second, you know, just to... Oh, there is a hidden item over here. I figured... Man, we get... Oh, no, it's it's down south. Let me know if you find any items, and uh, let me know where they are, and I'll do the same if I find they anything. They are... They're down below down there. Oh, we can get an encounter down there once we figure out how to get down oh, there. Oh, dude, this is where we got to go to next. We got the world tournament we have to do. We actually battle in the world tournament? Yes. Dude, and it is... And that. it is dangerous because I have lost Pokemon in this part of the game in that because it's battle after battle after battle. I think they heal you in between. I'm I'm not positive on that. Oh, and we got another what? Heartbreaker. Oh! Where's he at? In the town. On the far left-hand side of the town. He wasn't over there for me. Yo, it's Heartbreaker Charles. He's right here. I'm looking at him. Talk to him. See if he, see if I he makes you battle. I did. I did. He says, I'm a Heartbreaker. My name... Charles. Charles. So, um, I don't know where you're at, but you should quit fooling around. And we just, should do just, this. I don't think he actually challenges you. Yeah, he says right here, I wanted to get the attention of a girl I like, so I learned a new style of Pokemon battling. Its name, Rotation Battle. Want to learn about it? No. Oh, oh, because I so did the it's Rotation opposite. Battle. It's, it's opposite this time. So I would do Rotation and you would do Triple. Dude, if that's the case, he's about to get his ace whooped. Dude, are bro. we about to do this, Mike? I'm I'm down to clown. Let me let me just run on this one floor real quick just to make sure that you don't need to come Actually, here to grab an item. You know what we should do first, Mike? We should do what? the story stuff first. In case this battle goes really south on us. I'd hate you know, I'd hate to have to like you know, grind. At least we should save it for the end of the episode, if anything. Okay. Well like we should go do the story stuff, search the town, all that good stuff. And um, 
the only thing in this far building over here that I found was an Everstone given to you by some guy, and that's really not necessary for us. Not at all. I did find a move move tutor. That's kind of cool. Whoa. Yeah, he gives you he teaches you moves for red shards. Hmm. So my man, my man Heartbreaker Charles is out here riding his bike. You should make sure he's on yours too. He should be. I'm gonna look. I didn't see him. You said he was over there to the far left. Far left. He's on the he's on the side of the um like market building place. Right where you are there. Go to the left side of the building. Far left side. For me, it was just there. He is. Oh oh. Well, hello there, Charles. Hello. Hello, Charles. Charles Xavius. So we're gonna save. We're gonna save the Heartbreaker Charles. For, oh, there's a Team Plasma Grunt inside the flower shop. Oh, selling an, an old one. Ooh. What's he selling? Selling incense, uh, man. Increases yeah. psychic type moves, water type, grass type. Um, um, pure incense. Helps keep away wild Pokemon. That's a better, uh, um, that is a way better, um, repel. Uh, doubles battle prize money. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, I might buy that for real. Oh, I got a shell bell. That's not bad. Wax? No, that's definitely not good. It's not as good as a leftovers, but it's something. Dude, a lax incense and a luck incense may be the strat. Everybody I have is holding an item of more usefulness than a shell bell right now, so I think I'm gonna roll with that. There's an item back yeah. here. Oh, you always on. buying these. Found an item, a PP up. Let's go. Yo, that's actually Let's good. go. I know, right? I, I, I'm quite happy with that. That might be useful for like the um, moo milk. I'm buying a dozen. Just because I, you know, in these troublesome times that we're in, it's good to help local businesses. <laughs> yeah, yeah, buy locally, you know. Um, Dude, lately, like, real talk, I have been. Yeah. Like, I've been to, like, local coffee shops. I've been to, like... Um, well, you know, it's like, they don't they don't have the, ooh, the, gov the government right. funds to, um, you know, to pay their employees for being off or whatever, too, you know, like... Right. But, you know, at the same time, though, people... People are always saying that, and then it's like... I found something I mean, nine times better than a... This item right here is the best item in the whole game. An energy root. Increases 200 HP for the price of $800. There you go. I got, indeed, the expert belt. Now, that might be better than the... I'm, would that be better than the muscle band on Primate? Um, I, yeah. But that's, I think the expert belt is just for fighting type moves, whereas muscle band is for anything physical, I think. What is the effect of Rooney of the muscle band? I forget off the top of my head. The expert belt uh, boosts the power of super, oh, super effective moves. Oh. Ooh, I got an elixir. You got a PP I'm, up. I got an elixir. That's I'm thinking. I'm thinking of the black belt is what I'm thinking of. Mm. The expert belt just increases the power of super effective moves. So that'll be useful on anybody, really. Yeah, that's like a stab. Could you imagine a stab? A stab buffer, band basically. Boosting? I think. I think I should give it to Django and get rid of the scope lens. Am I gonna be more interested? Am I gonna be more interested in crits, or am I gonna be more interested in just more damage in general? Hmm. That's a good question. Because Django can land more crits with the scope lens, and I have gotten some pretty good crits with him. That is a good question. Hmm. Hmm. I'll. I think I'll wait. I think I'll wait. I. I I'm pretty sure the muscle band increases the power of physical moves. Or maybe it's contact moves, something like that. But either way, that's all Primeape has is contact and physical moves. So, um, I think I've pretty much swept this town clean, man. You've been in all the buildings, you think? Yes, sir. Nothing. Nothing new or out of the ordinary from what you had found. Gotcha. Alrighty then, I guess it is story stuff. Let's here. go. Let's go battle this bugger over here, huh? Let's go whoop up on some old men, you know? Yeah. I love the young people. Beat up old guys, huh? That's not what I want 
allowed to do. All right, you ready, man? Check really quickly what item I had on Slifer. The scope lens. You're looking for them grits. Um, you can put the expert am, belt on him. I am actually going to give him the um that new item we just got. The expert the, uh, belt to double to double my prize money. Oh, okay, okay. Where's it at? I don't know. Maybe I had one. I didn't realize. Oh, you got it. dude! You got a dragon fang. What are you doing? He he only has one dragon type move. Oh, what's he got? Um, he's got uh. I that thing called? Dude, I actually have some really hey, bomb items. You know what though? The expert belt would help any move that he uses as long as it's super effective. Where is the wax? Oh, the lax incense? I just saw it. It's right there. No, I'm at the luck incense. Where the hell? And I got a life orb. Okay, I ain't gotta worry about it. I ain't gotta worry about it. Life, right, life orb is cool, but scary in a nuzlocke. <laughs> yeah. If you were going to come inside, I would like to see what kind of person you are, trainer. That's right, in battle, battle, you find this acceptable? I forgot how to do Swedish for some reason. <laughs> All right, there he is. Ooh, it's baby Gertrude. Rich kid Noel. Noel. That's a weird way to spell. He has um, an Alola Mola. Uh, a Malola Mola. A Loli Bola. <laughs> a Roly Coley. Oh, Dylan, look at that. Oh, hey, you get to try that out. I tried that in the last episode. Dude, I'm staying in with Slifer, man. We're about to see. We're about to see what's up, man. We're about to see. I'm level 33. He's level 30. That's kind of scary, good? dude. What's good, dog? He ain't gonna one shot me. What's up? Ooh. You ain't one shot. Oh, yeah. I forgot. He didn't have. He didn't have much to hit me with. Oh, he does have Wrecked. Thunderbolt though. Wrecked. But you killed him, so we're good. Yeah, Coward. I was gonna say he did have Thunderbolt. I'm That's surprised. crazy. That's crazy that he had that lit. That he had Zekrom. That's crazy. <laughs> right. That this guy would have Zekrom, one of the legendaries they were after. Yeah, I think he's been doing some sneaky, sneaky under the table here. I've had this Pokemon for two years. <laughs> oh, it's a what? Vile Plume. Wait, he I'm only had need... one Pokemon for you? He had two. I, I, he had a um a Yon Mask that I had I had Crunch, dude. So I killed it when it hit. Ooh. Oh, I couldn't even one shot the vile plume. Are you kidding oh, me? Oh my enchantress! You are supposed to be. I really want to get you a legend, man. I really want to find you something like super clutch. But it can't be a dragon type. It can't be a psychic legend. So hey, what else is there? I just hit 101 um, experience, or I mean 101 HP on enchantress, and wants to learn mirror move, which I'm not really into. So yeah, let's I not do either. that. Keep old moves. Give up on mirror move. I remember always thinking that move was super cool when I was a kid because I'm like, oh yeah, I get to do the same move he's got. <laughs> but really, there's no practical use for yeah, it. <laughs> nothing. I apologize for testing you. Being former members of Team Plasma, we must deal with a lot. He got away. And that is... Your friend, he may join us. Yo. It's in the Zora. Let me introduce myself again. My name is Rude. You guys are all Team Plasma too, right? Tell me, what makes you different from the Team Plasma back there? More accurately, we're former members of Team Plasma. Because of the incident two years ago, we started taking care of the Pokemon that were separated from their trainers as a way to atone for our misdeeds. And you are? I'm Hoffman. You cannot hassle the Hoffman. From <laughs> Aspera City. Five years ago, Team Plasma, I mean you, stole my little sister's Pokemon. I'm the pathetic trainer who wasn't able to stop you. Separated. What a joke. You were the thieves who stole them. Is that so? My sincerest apologies. Just an apology? That's it? Where's my sister's Pokemon? Purloin! Where's Purloin? The Pokemon you speak of is not in this place. I imagine it is still being used by Team Plasma now. 
Just as you say, our apolo apologizing doesn't solve anything. But you can't move forward unless you admit you were wrong and apologize. Enough already! Apologizing isn't getting my sister's Pokemon back. DJ Spin, I'm going to the Pokemon gym. I'm gonna pump some iron. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get stronger and crush every single member of Team Plasma. Dude, I forgot how close these two gyms were, dude. I know, right? Team Plasma made trainers like him suffer. I feel terrible about it, how foolish we were. Phantom, as you can see, I can't do anything to thank you. Actually, I have a favor to ask you. Could you please look after this Pokemon oh, Zora? Woo! We get a freebie! Let's Dude. see what it is. Okay, hold on. Oh, okay. okay. We, gotta, we gotta see what gender, it is. Gender doesn't matter. Gender does not matter. Hold up, hold up. Mine says receive Zora. So does mine. Hold on. The Zora is one of the Pokemon that my Lord in relied on as a friend during his journey. Is it just the Zora? Uh, it yes. is. Whoa, I'm kind of surprised. Okay. I, I think that was supposed to be randomized. To be honest with you, it, it says the owner was in, dude. That's cool, dude. That is cool, dude. I want. I, I kind of want to play my game back just to get this Zora that has the owner in. Yeah, that's kind of cool. I wonder if you can shiny hunt that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I mean, it maybe could. I don't know. Um, do you want to use this as a token for like an encounter? We're probably gonna have to, honestly. I mean, that was... I don't know why that wasn't randomized. All of our other... All of our other gift Pokemon have been randomized, haven't they? Yep. Uh, where do you want to re-encounter it? Um, I want to re-encounter where we got the, uh... Why don't we just re-encounter at the most recent route again? So it's a decent level. Okay. You know? Fine. Fine by me, man. Waste my damn time. Alright, so you just want to re-encounter right here with us? Yeah, um, I might actually go pop a repel. I think there's some double battle grass somewhere down there. Ooh, you might be right, my, love, my friend. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna go see. I don't I don't think I have a repel, but I'm, I'm gonna go see if I can buy one here. Do I have a ripple? Do I have a ripple? Super Rapple. Yeah, I didn't have any, so. They're, oh, they're in the main bag, aren't they? They're not in the medicine bag. Uh, yeah, I think they are. Okay. I have five Rapples. Let's do this. Um, I'm gonna write Zora. And you can encounter first. Uh, let's see. What a guy. Who are you talking about? You. <laughs> Why? Me, let me encounter first. Well, it is your encounter first. Let's see if we can find some double battle grass in there, huh? That would be the strat. Yeah, I'm kind of bummed, though, honestly. I was really hoping for some crazy, like, freebie encounter. Swiftly dodged her. Oh, damn it. Run into a trainer? Yep. Dude, I wonder if there's a grotto in here. It's possible. Remember, we do have that one grotto that we can do. Um, oh, yep. And it mines a Groudon. Yes, it is. God, this trainer just sniped me, dude. Dude, and I don't think we have a ground type on the team, do we? We don't. Nope. Yo, that But that's the way we were going to do that is the next grotto we find, if I find a Pokemon in it. Oh, this lady had an unknown. <laughs> <laughs> um, if I if I find a Pokemon in it and you find an item, then we will pair oh, that. Oh, Pokemon. encounter! Oh God. shoot! Oh, that's uh, that's dupes. I think. Check the um. Uh, I'm pretty sure I have one. Janet, Debbie, Barrier, the OG, Stainless, Shadow, Flight, Iron Maiden. Oh, I feel like I um, have it, Dylan. What's this one? Minimal, I think I have an Exeggutor. Minimal, Slifer, Jumpy. Visage, Erica, Barry, and Muddy. That's what you got. I, I don't know what any of those are. <laughs> Dang, dude. I'm not sure. So you got a what is that? A grass type? Yeah. So that I doesn't. I have this Pokemon those worms. Hold up. It, it, no harm if I catch it. Yeah, you can always just release it or whatever. Um. 
Yeah, so we'll just I call it. We'll say so you got a I grass. It. You got a grass type, and, um... Dude, this is the first time we've ever had, like, an overabundance of grass Pokemon. It is weird, yeah. Okay, I got out of the, the thing without encountering another Pokemon anyway, so that's... You, that's didn't, you didn't put up a repel? I did, dude. Ooh, weird. It, it encountered anyway. Who'd you have up front? Uh, level 33, and the encounter was a level 25. Weird. Oh my gosh, this freaking Magnemite is giving me so much trouble right now. Gosh, get this thing out of here. I didn't, dude. What? So, grass type. Execute. Yep. Um, Adamant nature. Oh, that's convenient. So you didn't happen to see if there was double battle grass or not, huh? I never made it. Okay, I, I, I'm... Oh, God, there's items all over... Oh, wait, no, these are going to be... No, gosh, these trainers, man. Literally, they must be programmed to just spot you the second you run by them. Because, like, she looked away, looked back, looked away for a long time, and then I left, and she's like, boom, just turns right into me. I'm like, oh, oh okay, okay. Um, does the gender matter since it's based off of a gift Pokemon? Um, I don't know. I mean, I guess it could not, but at the same time, that we're oh Eggy is, uh, Eggy is male. Okay. I mean, I might shoot for, uh, I, I don't know. I don't look know at that, the, look at that. The effective repel wore off right now. How did a level, how did a level 25 encounter come to my level 33? Right? I know. That's what I'm saying. I, I don't understand that. Um, let's see, I got a throw here I'm battling. What a waste of encounter. Oh, I can't even one-shot a throw? Come on, Enchantress, what are you doing? I should be it's... able... Four levels above, I should be able to one-shot even a throw. I know throw is I, thick, but... I seen this Togekiss for a second, I was like, oh my god, I'm, I'm gonna die. And I was like, oh, it's not fairy type yet. Yep. Was it just normal flying? Yep. Okay, let's see. Oh, no, who's this guy? Is this a trainer? Yes, it is. Oh my gosh. So many trainers, Michael. Yeah. This well, is I felt, ridiculous. I, felt one. I am. I just want an encounter. I don't want to battle anybody. God. <sighs> How far are you up the route? I'm up to the little science building where the deerling stuff is. Holy crap. Yeah, I'm trying to see if I can get to where I thought there was. I'm pretty sure there's double battle grass around the corner. Oh, no! Oh, I almost lost Enchantress. What this are you freaking doing? This freaking dude. This Azumarill dude, that would have been a perfect encounter. This Azumarill almost freaking killed me. With the rollout? Honestly, I don't even know what he used. I was, like, talking to you and not really looking. And I went from, like, oh, he used Double Edge. Oh, dude. my God. That does half. Holy crap. Gertrude, get your hiney out here. Holy crap, dude. That was insane. I am so lucky I did not... Dude, Double Edge is ridiculous. I am so lucky I did not lose a Pokemon on that. I, double Edge is crazy. Like, oh. Dude, Super Potions cost $1,200. Heal you yeah. for 50 I know. It's, it's I ridiculous. Bought, I bought Moo Moo Milk for 500 a pop and got... And they heal for 100 Dude, he healing items from now on, I'm only buying from there, dude. Well, that's like me with my lemonade. Lemonade only costs three fifty, but dude, it, that it heals is legit me for the 80. strat. That is legit the strat on my cage lock. I have to save money, so yeah. I'm freaking just buying lemonades. And like I'm sitting the whole episode just click spam an A to get these lemonades, and the hmm. guys are like, "What are you doing, dude?" And I'm like, "Don't worry, it's an OG strat." Dude, this guy's using. Oh, that's why that Azumarill is doing so much damage. Huge power. Dude. He used, he used an X, well, he might, he might have oh. that too, but he used an X attack on it. Gotcha. I'm so, so over all these trainers, dude. Oh my god, I just want to, I just want an encounter. Is that so much to ask? Are we counting Shroomish as, uh, no we're not, are we? Shroomish? What about Shroomish? Reggie Gigas on the screen, okay. Please. Oh man, that would have been wild. We don't have a normal type on the team. And it's slow start. Okay, trainer, please don't battle Punch it me. out, buddy. Oh my goodness. 
Punch it out. Okay, charge stone cave. Here's double battle grass. Yep. Oh, route wait, is that six. a new route? No, it's route six. Oh no, a trainer! What ah! are you doing, DJ? Dude, Smith? they're everywhere. Every time I turn around, trainer here, trainer there. Air I'm smash. like, it's 25 minutes in, and I just want an encounter. I just, just want an encounter. That's all I want. That's all I've ever wanted this entire episode. Is I just want an encounter. I do not want to battle one more trainer. I am so sick of battling trainers. I just want to be done with this. I just want an encounter and get a new Pokemon, potentially to put on a team, but I can't because you already got a freaking grass type. But still, I'm just freaking irritated right now. I am so irritated with this right now. So why do there have to be so why do there have to be so many trainers? Why? We're already level 35 across the board. Why do there's gotta be so many trainers? <sighs> and it's like now I might have to go heal my Pokemon because everybody's almost dead after all these goddamn battles, dude. And fifth gen speed up does not speed up like I wanted to. You could get through a regular battle in first through third gen with speed up in like ten seconds. This. Is just like it kind of almost slows the game down when you speed up in this. I think it's the ROM. Oh, I found I found a lock since over here by accident. Wow. I just wow. want an encounter. Stop hurting yourself, Gertrude. I just want an encounter. Can we please kill this thing? I just want a double. Oh, oh my it's God. a Pokemon. We're not counting the Shroomish encounter. Okay, yeah, the, the Shroomish aren't randomized. You what? mean you mean Fungus? Yeah, that's what I meant, but it's not randomized. That's weird. Yeah, I don't know. I couldn't tell you, Mike. Hmm. It seems like 90% of the time when I do these randomizers, they do not randomize what I want them to. It's like they don't random... Because remember the last... I think it might, it might be this generation, honestly. Because remember we had that problem in the last one. And I yeah. could have swore that I randomized all the statics. But the statics were not randomized. in it. And I, and I remember that happening as I was randomizing these ones. So I don't know why we're having these issues. Hmm. I feel like it's got to be just the 5th gen randomizer. I don't know. New video, okay. Dylan. How to so, randomize 5th gen properly. So, yeah, I can if I don't know how to do it myself. Okay, so all my Pokemon are almost half dead. And I just healed them up with potions. And I got an encounter in the double battle grass. And it is... Oh, great! A Swinub and a Hopip. And they're both well, male. You can only... Oh, okay. I was about to say, you can only catch the swine of Did so. we decide that we're going to try to make it a male-female pair? Yeah. Okay, then I am running. I decided that right now. <laughs> Executive decision. Next is... We're a team. Ooh! A Hopip and cool. a Caracosta. A.K.A. And Hopip. And Hopip is a grass type, so I can't, and Caracosta is a male. But these levels are pretty nice, honestly. Considering that Zora is level 25, these are level 29-ish. Yeah, I got a 25 out of mine. Oh, a fire type. Please be female. Oh, they're both male. Um, I retract what I said earlier. <laughs> uh, <coughs> okay. Come on. I waited all this time to get to an encounter spot. And it's a solo swine up, and it is a female, so there it is. Wow. Wow. He avoided my hypnosis, and he used Mud Bomb, and it does not affect me. What a jerk. He avoided a second hypnosis, and used a second Mud Bomb that still does not affect me. Finally, I landed a hypnosis. I'm thinking I bought the... There it is. I already had a look since it's always said nine grand on that. Did you nickname that um execute? I I did not, but I know what I what I would have named him. His name is Eggy. Hey, you know, uh Executor and Mamoswine? Yo, you know what? Uh, that's a good shout. Mamoswine's in this generation, right? He's in generation no, yeah. four. Yeah. Yeah, he's in. I had to think about it for a second. I did too. <laughs> One, two, three. Caught it! 
female swine up. Bomb mushroom black. Primary ice, actually. We have to remember that. It is a primary ice type. Oh, it's ice type? It is. Swine up, the pig Pokemon. Rooting the tip of its snout into the ground, it searches for food. Sometimes it even digs up a hot spring. Ooh. Look at that. And then what? dies because it's ground type. <laughs> what am I gonna name this swine up? This female lady swine up. Um. Oh man, I remember. I have a great nickname, but I don't want to say it. We had a swine up in. I want to say Look Dusty. Look at all those chickens. I want to say Dusty had a swine up in one of our playthroughs we did, but I can't remember what he named it. I'm pretty sure he had a swine up. Dude, this dude's giving me a deerling for free. Okay, hold on. That's another one. Well, shoot, that's probably not going to be randomized either. Yep. Dude, that's so disappointing. Why is this... So Check why it. is this deerling rare? Check it. Oh, I don't know about that. I don't know why it's rare, but... Oh, it's it's oh it was randomized. Holy crap, why is that one random? Okay, hold on. Hold on, Mike. We're Level 30 spinner rack, dude. Oh, I didn't even nickname my spinner rack. God damn it. Oh, what are you doing, Mike? Well, um, I didn't know. I thought I'm, we were fucked. I'm naming this uh, Swine Up Stripes. Dude, this... What? I Okay, spinner rack gets sniper? Dude, that's pretty dope. I never knew that. Never knew that. Dude, look at these movesets, though. Shadow Sneak, Fury Swipe, Sucker Punch, and Spider Web. Yo. Not bad. That's pretty interesting. Okay, and then you named that one Eggy. Okay. And then this is going to be the Deerling. Mm-hmm. The, the, the stats are absolute garbage, but... Well, yeah, but it hasn't evolved yet. That's true. Um, okay. Oh, I, I'm going to have... Is there a... Is there a PC in that building? Nope. Ah. Uh... Why, you don't have a full party. Yeah, I do. How do you have a full party? I have the Zora and the Swinub making so it. Just send it to the box. We can't add them anyway because uh, it's a bug type. Uh, trainer. What are you doing? Dude, I'm just I'm just going to kill them all. I'm killing them all. I'm murdering everybody. Do you not know how to battle? I do. I actually am very, very familiar with battling now because that's all I've been doing this entire episode. I don't, don't know how to dodge trainer, man. Dude, they're just, they're just everywhere. Every time you turn around, I'm trying to get out of here. I just don't want to be here anymore. And they just... Eh, there's another one. I'm going to battle this one, too. Arr, this is the most frustrating I've ever been. <laughs> so, so frustrating, dude. And it's not like... It's all weak Pokemon. They're level 30. I'm one shot and everything. I'm like, dude, just quit wasting my time. Ooh, a squirt pole. I just want to see what the what the random Pokemon is. Oh, use knockoff and almost. Oh my gosh, Sabli. I'm Sabli. I'm I'm done. Oh my God, Shadow Sneak. Shadow Sneak. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. He's actually gonna kill me. <sighs> Shield on. Django, let's go. Does fighting resist rock? <coughs> that is a good question. He had sturdy, and he wasted his sturdy by using iron defense. What a scrub. What a scrub. <coughs> That's four times super effective, because I'm pretty sure he's rock and steel. Excuse me, yo. All right, I well... Have... Mystic water. Now that I've effectively battled about 50,000 trainers. Another Unreal. Did you go check out the Pokemon? No, because I have a full party. I gotta go back and change out my party. And after we do that, we're calling it quits for the episode. We're already... That, yeah. We're already way over time. You're absolutely right. We're like 17 minutes over. Not quite. 37. We're like maybe five minutes. If over. this video gets 100 likes, it's gonna be an hour of power. Well, <laughs> we won't know that yet. <laughs> <laughs> I do. I'll, I'll know. Yeah. 
I know things. You know you um, could fly now, right? Uh, I don't have a flying Pokemon on my team. Sigilith? I mean, he could learn it, but I haven't taught him fly. Oh. Just because he's not a physical attacker and I'm trying to, like, not die. Oh yeah, I forgot I went back to the Pokemon Center to swap out my Pokemon, and I didn't do that. I just healed and left. Sweet. Good job. This episode's gonna be eight. It's gonna be eight hours long because I can't get my crap together here. Give us 17 likes for this video if you guys have made it this far. Ugh, so annoyed right now. It's a sfeel. This uh, Swinub has Endure, Mud Bomb, Icy Wind, Ice Shard. And no, he's I'm... holding an Asperberry. Hey, at least it's got an Asperberry. Yeah. Um, Zora, I don't know what we're going to do with you. I'm just going to set you in a random box for now. Alrighty. Uh, let's close out of here. Now that I got my party back to clear. Let's see. It's level 30, huh? Hopefully, man, what did you, what did you get on yours? It was a bug type, right? Spinarak. Sweet. Means we can't add it, dude. What if it's something busted, though? <clears throat> oh, then we what can if... talk about Iron Maiden and... I mean, I could probably do without, um... Without Django, to be honest. Dude, there's a Powdon out here. I should've <clears throat> just encountered out here. If it's something that will benefit you, then I'd be down. Well, I currently have two big flying-type weaknesses. That's what I'm saying. If it's something that benefits you... Like, half my team, actually, exactly half my team is, is weak to find. But your luck, it's probably going to be a Bidoof. I mean, yeah, probably. You know. Oh, yeah, I forgot you're a trainer that I feel like I already battled. Why are we battling again? Why you probably already battled. This is really annoying. <laughs> I can't it believe is. you. I, it is. I, this is a stupid unknown lady. Oh, my. Kill me. This is the longest, most annoying episode. All, we, all we've accomplished today is one story battle. And we're going to do Heartbreaker Charles. Ah! I'm so mad. You ruined Heartbreaker Charles. Dude, I wanted to do that so bad. You ruined my chances at Heartbreaker Charles. Dude, blame the game. Blame the designers. This is terrible game design. Let's make let's make eight thousand trainers in one route with booty Pokemon that don't matter, and let's make some trainers battle you twice every time you every time you come by them they battle you again. That makes no sense. None. Ugh. Now that I have successfully been completely triggered, it's gonna be the name of this episode is Tilted and Triggered. Tilted and triggered. Yep. Deerling, I received the deerling. Let's see. Yours doesn't what... randomize. Dude, it probably <laughs> won't. That's literally what happens. Mine is a cast form. Pretty much nailed that one. <laughs> uh. I, f I we better switch our team out for that. Route six. Ooh, we. Get, I mean, we, there's an encounter right here. Where? Oh, Chargestone Cave. Yeah, we'll have to do that in the next episode. I named him. I named her Wumbo. 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 A worthless level thirty cast form. Boy, that is just something. With a lax nature, it has Rain Dance, Sunny Day, Hail, and Weather Ball. Could you imagine is... if that would have been like Garatina? Uh, could I imagine if it was anything good at all? No, actually, Probably I can't. Not. Probably not. Probably not. You're not allowed to do such things. I'm not allowed to have nice things. Never. I, I have a Zora in my team. Or in my party. Uh, what? I have a Zora in oh, my Oh, you have a Zora arc. Yeah, 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 yeah. I do recall now, actually. Now that you mentioned I think that. I called it in. I called, no, I called it Visage. Yes. I think, or no, you named it Shadow, didn't you? No, I called it Visage. What, what, what do you have on your team that's, that's named Shadow? The, uh, that was what was linked with Zangoose. Another trainer. Another trainer, Dylan. What are you doing? What are you doing? 40 you're walking, minutes of you're trainers. Walking, you're walking into them on purpose now. 
Oh my gosh. I just want to be done. You are literally walking into them on purpose. I just want to be done. I just so don't want... At least you're going to kill it in one hit with a psychic or an air slash. It's, it won't be one hit because it's a Sigilith. It's not going to one shot. See? Look at that. Barely did half. It confused him. He got the conf and he's going to hit himself in confusion. Honestly, oh my god, look how good Sigilith is. Sigilith is really starting to show its its flaws. It's really starting to show its weakness, honestly. Yeah, it's it's, it's like, getting up there in levels, but so is everything else, so now its base dude, stats are like... its special attack is still only 101 at level 37, which is fine, but its physical attack is 58, its defense is 69, its special defense is 59, it has no Ooh. defenses. Ooh. Like one one good knockoff, one stab knockoff from anything, Dunzo. Dunzo. Put that focus sash on him. Well, that's why I have leftovers on it because. Don't go not? that way. Go down there. Because why not? Walk yeah. past it. You'd have battled the unknown again. We, oh I my think god. We would have stopped this whole playthrough. Yeah, I'd be like, well, we're canceling this playthrough, guys. We're done. All right. Well, that's the end of this extremely long, uh, frustrating, uh, tilted and triggered episode. It, it wasn't is, that bad. Is it, you For weren't me. on my end. <laughs> I know. I know. Oh, man. And I have a Rayquaza. Yeah, I know. Everything I mean, just, if you want, we can change the team up a bit. You can at least have a Mew. Everything's just sunshine and breezes over there in Michael we, Land. We, we might need to talk about it because Sigilyph's base stats are really bad. Ugh. I we mean, might have to talk about it. Yeah, I mean, I got a Prime Ape, which is average. I have just a regular Heracross, which is okay, but he's got way too many weaknesses. My best Pokemon is by far Cofagrigus. Best Pokemon. True. True. And, and that's not even, like, saying that, like, that's bad. I mean, Cofagrigus is good in all respects. But, like, yeah, I, I, I don't know. I don't know what I got going on here. I'm going to deposit this booty little cast form that... It's never gonna be used. Ever. Dude, what a terrible pair. Cast form and Ariados. Let's be honest. Yeah, we we got two chances for in Paris again today and completely got screwed. Yeah, terrible. Like I don't really even have be besides the Celebi and the Crocorock, I don't really have much for power on my team. I have a side. Who's Crocorock linked with? Uh I named him Charlie. Charlie is linked with Erica. That must be a vile plume. Yeah. That's not a bad pair at all. Hold up, hold up, hold up. No, it's an Oddish. But that's fine. Yeah, it's an eventual Vile Bloom. And what's that thing's... What is he, ground? He's primary ground, yeah. Why didn't we add him before? Because we already have a grass type. Oh, see, in one fighting type move, will kill that thing in one hit. Maybe. I mean, I know it's fighting super is, is super effective. Who would that open up? That wait, that, what that is doesn't, what is that doesn't oh, open dude. up anything. Hey, hey, if yes it does. If we get rid of We Ferrothorn, could do the cast form and spinner rack pair. <laughs> yeah, we could do that. Yeah. <laughs> oh we Now could you're do just that. thinking crazy, Mike. <laughs> we could do if if you if you need if you know, the only reason why I would say spinner rack cast form is for death fodder if we needed it honestly i could make cast form work in the sense that if i needed weather to setups. have a boost i could do weather setups yep i could literally just bring um, him in and sunny day and then switch out but i don't have a fire type to utilize it i don't have a water type to utilize it i don't even have an ice type to utilize it true sandstorm? also also if we were doing sandstorm a... ah Sandstorm doesn't have a sandstorm. No, like, no, but I, but I could get rid so of I could get rid of sandstorm. But anyway, um, we could also do if we're getting rid of a grass type, we could do the swineub and execute pair, get rid of which? our grass and bug pair, which mm -hmm. would still open up the cast form and spinner rack pair. Mm -hmm. So then we'd have a I'd ha I, we'd have a potential mammoth swine and executor, and a spinner rack and cast form. That is also true. You know. Um, but beyond that, that's really all we can do for switches, I think. We have, we have, so we can get rid of one pair to add two pair. There's yeah. something to talk about there. Yeah, for sure. Who is Zoroark linked with? Uh, Ludicolo. That is a water type, primarily. Hmm. We could talk about some stuff, I guess. 
Yeah, we really we have two moves that we can make, two potential moves that we can make there. We can where, do this and get two, we... or we can do this and get two. Yep. But who is better for you, Crocker Rock or? Uh, honestly, they're they're pretty similar Pokemon. It'd be mm -hmm. it'd be either be a Crocodile or a Mamoswine. And you're we're yeah we'd both be getting rid of the same the Ferrothorn, Heracross pair. Yes. Yep. Okay. I can do without Heracross or without Ferrothorn. I mean, I do love the Ferrothorn. Okay, like, okay, I think that's a good Pokemon. We're, we're just rambling on. We, yep. we apologize. Yeah, you guys probably all cut off the episode by now, <laughs> yeah. so DJ Spinner might do some editing on this. But anyway, I'm gonna do my outro. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please smash that like button. DJ Spinner really needs some support here, guys, because he was getting drugged through the mud the whole episode. Um, go down in the description, check out the merch. We got some coffee mugs for the Soul Link. Support is always greatly appreciated. I'm the Phantom Michael. That's DJ Spinner. We're gonna get the heck out of here. We will see you guys in the next one. Later.